team coverage of how this global pandemic is impacting you here in southeast Minnesota. But first, our Uba Ali checked into how testing works up at the new drive up locations if you are feeling symptoms. It's a drive up, drive through. The process is pretty simple. You just pull up. Hello. So we're just going to swab the back of the throat. So this next one's going to go down through the nose. So if I can have you open your mouth, breathe through your mouth you'll be notified of those results. Thank you. Thank you. With the first COVID-19 case found in an Olmsted County resident, health officials say the need to get testing done has increased. Until we had this set up, a lot of the testing was being done through emergency department. Mayo Clinic Medical Director of Emergency Management, Dr. Pratish Tosh, says this new testing site takes some of the pressure off of the ER department, but before you get tested, you need to make a call. If you're having fever, and, um, and, and these sort of respiratory symptoms, that's a good time to start contacting your primary care office. And once you make that call to your physician, they will advise you on what is next. In order uh, to, to go through this testing, we really need people to call their primary care office. Testing, as you saw, takes no more than five minutes. Then you're given a self-isolation guideline while you wait for test results to come back from the Minnesota Department of Health. As for the future of this new testing site. As long as we have this robust testing need um, and uh, this is the right solution for that robust testing need, we'll have this up. Up and open seven days a week. In Rochester, Uba Ali, KTTC News.